Hello and welcome back to Fallout New Vegas with your story loads in the mad. I load the flow are which is preferring both a two boxes mad when good as well as thirteen and all around neutral guy. I wonder if Dr. Ada Strauss has exactly the sort of medicine I'm looking for. Let's go ask him. Her. Huh. Hello. Hello. I'm just gonna put my hat on. My hat off. This is a trade, right? That's what my hat is called. The hat of this is a trade, right? The Roman trader hat. What can I do for you? I need medical supplies. Yeah, and I need sterile medical supplies. But let's see what I have with me. Haha. <laughs> I like this sense of humor, lass. I like it. Give me all the stim packs. Shut up and give me the stim packs. This will do, I guess. Another satisfied customer. See you later. Bye. I was unable to sell a single one of my RCWs because all of them. Careful! They got spies all over. Hello. Who sent you? I ain't talking. They tried to get me to talk before, but I didn't say nothing. And I don't aim to now, by gum. I think there's a hair stuck inside my mouse here. Uh, let me get that. <sighs> yeah, that seems to help. I think, maybe. I don't know. Who tried to make you talk? Confound it, no bark. You've done it again. You let on that you know things. Now they'll never let you be. All right, stranger, you got me. What do you want to know? Uh, bye. If anyone asks, we never spoke. We never spoke. Hi. Howdy. You're a settler. That's not nearly as interesting as um, that other gentleman. That is of the no bark variety. Many Vargas's room, motel room, motel room, motel room, motel room. There are two motel rooms that are free to enter and suffer no penalty from such an action. So let's check them out. Hello, Bruce. Oh, please don't kill me. I swear I'll have... Wait, you... You don't work for Mr. Bishop, do you? No, no, I don't. What makes you think that? Sorry, it's just... You look like his type, you know? You got that hard-ass wasteland explorer thing going on. Oh. Aren't you that singer from New Rena? I think I saw you play the clubs there. Oh, so you have heard of me. Yeah, that's right. Uh, I was the big draw at the Shark Club. People used to pay hundreds of caps to see me. But you come all the way out here from New Reno. You don't know Mr. Bishop. He's not like other bosses up there. He knows the wasteland like the back of his hand, and he likes to wander it. I knew if I didn't get way the hell away from New Reno, he'd run me down like a dog. Well, what does Mr. Bishop be after you? Oh, well, that's all just a big misunderstanding, see? Mr. Bishop, well, he owed me a lot of money, and, uh, you know, he's a busy guy, so I sort of figured I'd just take it off his hands. And so because of that, you ran all the way to Nowak. I figured it might take him a while to understand his accounting error and cool down a little. Also, I might have uh, sort of plowed his daughter a little. Well, I'd like to know if I find any work for a singer. You do that? Great. I really appreciate that. See you around. Uh, yeah, yeah. See you later. I could just shoot you in the face. Uh, I guess that's bad that he quit there. Freeze! There's no one there. Let's try the next one. You are home? Fine weather for flying. 
It's times like these that make me miss it all. You're a pilot? Vertebrate pilot. 71 missions and only lost one chopper. Rotor malfunction over Klamath. Hard landing, but I walked away. Did you fly for the NCR? Four? No, not exactly. It was a long time ago. Things are a lot different these days, and those days are way behind me. You were on Clave. What do you do in Novak? I help folks strip down the more complicated bits of salvage they bring in. Engines, mostly. The bits and pieces we take out are usually worth more than the whole thing put together. Nice. Watch your six out there. I won't. Bye-bye. All right, and here we have who's home? Range and the cliff. Cliff's this guy, right? Right, probably. Welcome back. Can I get you anything? You still read the active material in your rocket souvenirs? I, uh, well, I don't really know. Would that sour you on buying one if it did? Tell more about the souvenir rockets. They're scale replicas of the real thing. Very detailed. Got a liquid in them that makes them glow. From what I hear, Repcon used to give them out on tours of their HQ up in Henderson. But I guess they had to stop after the first few kids thought they were filled with Nuka-Cola and drank it down. The papers had a name for the condition and everything. They called it the Repcon Shakes. Those were bad times for Robco. How did they end up here? Well, they unloaded what they had left on the dino bite as a tax write-off, but that was before my time. Plenty of demand for them, seeing as how they're one-of-a-kind collector's items, but I might still have some in back. I'd like to buy all of your remaining rocket souvenirs. Really? I never thought I'd see the day. I mean, the day I'd part with them for such an incredibly low price, with so many other offers flooding in. <laughs> but I like you. I think maybe it's time. All that's left is in the storage room here. You can buy the key from my store. All right, let's see what we can do. Sure thing. Have a look. You have like one, one singular cap left. So let's see. Dinobite store room. Oh, that's actually pretty expensive. Let's see if I can actually find something for it. Actually, yeah, I just take the key and go. See ya. Come back soon now. That's quite a few of rocket souvenirs, isn't it? Yes, get them all. <laughs> I don't know how many you actually need. I think I have enough, but you know. There's no need to take the risk. Let's just take it all. Can I have all of this as well? Yes, I can. What a joy. Come on, let's go rockets. I can't have that gun there. Unless... Nice. Alright, so... Do, 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 do. Any more rockets? Oh no, I took a think it's the same as her. So near. Right, so I have... Oh. I removed every single one of the... Oh, hello, ammo. I removed every single fuel. Oh, I know that's more rocket souvenirs. How you doing? A bit radioactively, but that's fine, you know. Normal dudes tonight. You have any luck with the ghouls? I'm counting on you. I'm gonna launch them off to space. See ya. Yeah, see ya. Right. 
Do I still don't know where I'm supposed to go and find what the other thing I needed. What was the other thing I needed? The rocket pits. I'm supposed to deliver the fuel and then ask about the rocket pits, I guess. Yeah. Alright, and then we are here, which means we can go over here and stick our faces in this radioactive hellhole. Could I have used the shortcut before the mess began? Probably. Yo. Have you found the components we discussed? What about this rocket souvenirs? The stuff inside close? Yes, that's isotope 239, all right. And there's enough here to launch the rockets. Now all I need is the thrust control modules. Can you give me any tips for my current task? Scavengers wouldn't know the value of the modules just by looking at them. If you know any junk dealers in the area, I'd start there. All right, see ya. Later. So, I just go back to the same person again. Fine. That should work. Oh no, I'm supposed to go to Gibson Great Scrapyard. Suppose we're traveling north. Careful. They got spies all over. I know. I saw one. Just yesterday. They looked like a normal monkey boy, but in reality, they were a baboon. Another boy at that. Okay, let's just go into the scrapyard. That should work. It's probably best if we wait for day. Yay, yay, or something. Morning, at least. Sounds like it might be wise, you know? Might be wise indeed. I just decided to blabber on instead of skipping the whole thingy. Oh well, that occasionally happens. Hello, Bazura. And Colmilla. And Ray. And Gibson. Hi there. I'm old lady Gibson, or so they tell me. I've got odds and ends for sale, and I'm pretty good at fixing things, too. You might have noticed the very large building just north of here. That's Helios 1. The NCR runs the place, so it's off limits to prospectors. Do you have any trust control modules from Repcon in stock? As it so happens, I do have some thrust modules, but they're expensive. 500 caps worth of expensive. Oh well. Pleasure doing business with you. Oh well. Oh well. Oh well. Hi, Phil. And Odas. Oh, it's like a crazy dog lady. What does she feed them? I hope the answer is not people. The answer is most probably people. This is the wastelands after all. This is the wastelands indeed. Quite indeed. Oh god, I just pushed over the tin cans. I'm sorry Aldas, I know you worked too hard for, to get them all like that, but uh, I'm sorry. I'm not gonna mess with these do dogs' and stuff anymore. In fact, I'm gonna climb into this dumpster and never show my face again. Or, whoops. Or I could just, you know, return to the test site. So yeah. Once again, turn around and jump into the ditch. Woohoo! Because, babe, that sounds like a completely reasonable thing to do. Yeah. Okay, hi. Have you found the components we discussed? Yes. 
Take him. Indeed you did. And they seem to be in excellent condition. The records are set to go, right? Yes. I'll tell Jason that the great journey can begin. We have everything we need to launch the rockets, Jason. The great journey can begin. Where is the viewing platform? How do I get to the viewing yeah, platform? All. May the Creator guide my words and help me speak true. The Almighty Creator has seen fit to answer our prayers. The time has come for us to board the rockets and begin the great journey. Though it may seem that all humans despise us, the Creator has seen fit to instruct us differently. The journey ahead would have been impossible if not for the intercession of two human friends. One you, the other a long abiding companion. To our new friend, we say thanks and promise never to forget how he cleared from our path the demons who sought to stay our journey. But to Chris, we owe more than thanks. Chris, you have made this great journey a reality. From this moment forward, you will be remembered as the saint of the great journey. We shall never forget you. I ask that you forgive us, Chris, and give us your blessing. And we bestow ours upon you. Seekers, more the rockets. Take your seats. The great journey awaits. To the promised land we go. To the far beyond. Hey. Hello. Hey. 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 Are they talking to each other down there? Or is that him? Did you hear him? My god, you were right all along. I'm no ghoul. They were just using me. They take you if they could, Chris, but you die. And dying would be worse than this? Used up and thrown away like garbage? You're going to revere you as a saint, Chris. Oh, so I've redeemed the human race, is that it? What a crock. The human race can't stand me. You're alright. So, you want me to accompany you on your adventures across the wasteland, is that it? There's a little down called Novak Tend Road. Life among humans again? That's what you're suggesting? I guess... I guess it's the only chance I've got. Maybe it'll be different this time. I was never a saint before. I can't believe I'm agreeing to this, but I'll give it a try. You go launch the rockets. I'm on my way to Novak. I don't know. I could shoot you. If that makes you feel better. Except I can't actually hit you from here. Because I'm terrible. I'm a horrendous shot. Where's the pathway to the actual viewing ch thingy? I'm gonna follow the arrow because I trust the arrow for now. Plus there was a locked door on the top of the structure. It may or may not be the actual direction to where I need to be. Go. Pee 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 go go pee pee. Go pee pee. Wait, no, don't do that. But yeah, go and Be present at that location, that might work. Yeah. Anyone here? Nope. Right, this was the way. Guess we're gonna climb these stairs. And um, all of platforms. And then climb to and try to climb the stairs again. That should work. Indeed. It should. Unless we fall off again. In which case, it will not work. Because in that case, I will fall. Most likely to my demise. Joy. 
무슨 힘이야? 음. Examine the trajectory is a little further. It looks like the computer said to take a non-optimal route to the specified specified destination. You surmise that with minor alternations, you can plot a course that will take them about. 12.5% closer to their intended destination. Do you wish to alter the rocket's course? Yes. Launch. Oh yes. Sit back, enjoy some tea and launch some rockets. Oh yeah, dude, it's very sad. Oh hi, bye. I didn't hope to do crash into anything. Oh, well, the Nova Keys like me now. That's nice. And we leveled up. Even nicer. Alright, so I don't know. I could go with. Hmm. Let's do non standard things with this level. What to do with these three points? Guns sound good. Yeah. What else is there here? I think I'll go with Mathrath. Alright then. I'm back to Nova Kigo. Oh, fine. Oh, the music stopped. Guess that's okay. Well, it's going for a new round. And now it's stopped completely. I wonder if someone turned on my radio somehow. So I don't remember doing that. Radio, you're not on, are you? No, you're not. Right, so this... Is this an exit? No, it's locked door. That didn't, didn't expect that one. Oh, hi. I haven't to explored the toilets here. There may be toilet loot. Are you toilet loot? You're not. Oh well. They promised to take their feral ghoul friends with them, so... Let's hope that actually happened. Hey, how are you still here? Taking all your stuff. Guess I didn't notice the bugger. Most likely explanation indeed. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Mushroom, are you the only one living here? Don't you dare fade out, Mushroom. Come on, shine. Good mushroom.